wafanye mpango wa tufungulia ofisi yetu hapa Nakuru. Kwa maana tumeona wakoro wametokea kila mmoja anasema kama yeye ni chairman. Imefa no person is supposed to hold a public office if they are not doing the right thing in their offices. Hii chama hii hii chama hii ni bunge la wananchi. Hii iko na chama vyote ya voters uh, uh, and uh, and uh, and uh, Kenya Kwanza. So aliwaambia kwamba kwa sababu mmenifukusa nimeongea kama mchungaji. Kikuyu brothers, you are telling us that William Ruto is your kingpin. Now you are suffering a Bunga wewe? Oye. Bunga wewe? Oye. Kwa mje ni William Koki. Naongea maneno mawili tu ambayo naona inanisumbua mwananchi wa bunge la Manyata. Na nitamwarifu through Biblia. Mimi kama mtumishi wa Mungu namwambia kwamba mali ambayo serikali imetuelekesha aliye na Biblia asome kitabu cha Amos 2. Aone jinsi Mungu alituma Amos kwa mfano wa Israeli ilipokuwa inatengisika kinyi Kenya inatengisika naye Amos alipoingiliwa naye alichibu kutoka Amos 7 mlango wa 14 aliwaambia kwamba kwa sababu mmenifukusa nimeongea kama mchungaji namwambia kwamba sisi kama bunge la Nakuru dukua manyata mambo ambayo serikali imetuelekeza tunapotaka kupanga mambo yetu ya bunge la Nakuru tunasuhuliwa vitina chuki na watu ambao hawana msimamo pili ninaomba eh, kiongozi wetu wa upinzani mheshimiwa Molo Odinga vile chairman alituacha ali Mr Peter Losono wafanye mpango wa tufungulie ofisi yetu hapa Nakuru kwa maana tumeona wakoro wametokea kila mmoja anasema kama yeye ni chairman imefanya hata sisi hapa tunapopanga mipango yetu wakoro wanatuingilia wanatufunga na tusipokaa imara kama bunga na Nakuru Tunaenda kuchomeka tunaenda kupata laana kwa sababu ya mitoma ya wanadamu. Kuna hata ambao wameitoka kwa sababu kutafuta kuta, kuta, utajiri wa haraka. Kusuhia mambo yetu yaharibika, kusuhia bunge letu yaharibika. Mwanaji anapotoka kuongea, wakora wanakucha, proko wanakucha, wanafunga kila kitu. Kwa sababu atakuwa na ofisi, chama na ambao atakuwa anaturu kwa hiyo kwa hiyo ofisi. Nimeshukuru viongozi wote ambao wameanzisha wamesimama imara tutaendelea kuunga mkono na kuunga mkono na serikali ni viongozi ambao walio walio katika ofisi kuu tutakuwa pamoja nao Asante Mungu amani awapariki Hata siski bunge hoye bunge hoye tena good fine okay kwa majina my name is Sarah Mr Robert Makoha Wangoho this morning i don't have much to say number one i'm talking about the former Uh, uh, I mean DPP that is director of public prosecutions this is none other than one Nuruddin Haji who is the son to the former senator Yusuf Haji you all know him now according to our Kenyan draft constitution 2010 no person is supposed to hold a public office if they are not doing the right thing in their offices Mr Haji Nurdin is known to have dropped several cases which are related to graft since Kenya Kwanza government occupied office I'm talking about a case whereby he withdrew uh, uh, concerning the NHIF boss that was amounting to 2.2 billion shillings i'm not forgetting the case nurdin haji we did drew this case was about a uh, graft where the deputy president mr rigadi kachagwa was uh, being accused of graft amounting to 7.5 billion shillings now if you are a kin yesterday the human rights societies including uh, tisa they stood and said that we are not going to accept the president's appointment of nordin haji to head the nis office i mean the national intelligence services we totally refuse 
even as bunge la wananchi na kuru we are saying no to that kind of nomination or appointment by the president because we need appointments to be for people who have qualified in a near future and any appointment should not be coerced by the government haji is known to have been pushed by the government in the recent past because of political affiliations because of uh, political coercion that is not what is provided for in our Kenyan constitution finally because of time kikuyu brothers you are telling us that william ruto is your kingpin now you are suffering a rot so, uh, right now there is something that is going on uhuru who is your kingpin is being humiliated as your leaders the likes of ichungwa are clapping behind him i'm telling you a time is coming once ruto successfully takes jubilee party from uhuru kinyata that chama is going to be folded to join kenya kwanza completely and ruto will now begin taking advantage of the kikuyus in the whole country mutafutwa hizo masies jobs mshangae sana instead of joining uhuru kinyata to fight for your rights and have your own party you are celebrating when uhuru kinyata is humiliated your time is coming and you will regret the rest of your lives weta na mutavadi sio wajinga wao wamekataa kuvunja vya madhao nc na for the kenya kikuyus wanashangilia ruto aki angaisha uhuru kinyata your time is coming you will all die politically and ruto will gain your ground you will never reclaim it in the rest of your life thank you very much as i said my names are mr robert makoha wangoho thank you very much have a good day hii chama hii hii chama hii ni bunge la wananchi hii iko na chama vyote ya both azimio and 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 kenya kwanza so here ndo maana tulianza hiyo kitu ambayo inaitwa bunge la wananchi bunge la wananchi kila mtu ameruhusiwa kutoa maoni yake kusema mimi serikali imefanya vizuri sawa mimi mimi naweza pinga serikali imefanya vibaya sawa ndo maana tumeweka hii kama bunge la wananchi si atubagui kila mtu ameweza pata watu wa hiyo chama ingine kutoa maoni watu wa Kenya kwa hapa oh kusema tu kweli eh, kusema tu kweli hao watu wa Kenya kwanza wamefinywa na maisha pia hao hata hawawezi tetea ndo maana ukiwaona hapa kuna most most people here wenye walikuwa hapa wakipigi, wakishangilia ruto hata wengine wali, walifunga mnyasi wakiserekea hapa lakini leo hii wakikuja hapa wanapinga huyo serikali tena wanaita jambazi so ndo maana unawaona hapa haya hey. tunauliza je mtu wa Kenya kwanza akitoa maoni yake hapo na aunge pengine serikali aseme pengine serikali iko sawa yeye mlichukulia kama ni maoni yake ama mleza kasirika na maoni yake in in this country we have something that we call democracy which is the government by the people for the people uh, by the people for the people and what and the people so umeruhusiwa kusema kila kitu umeruhusiwa kusema unapinga ama una support i think hiyo iko sawa another question uchaguzi umesema ikuwe lini uchaguzi tumesema itakuwa on wednesday and uh, we think it will be live hata Raila Amolo Odinga atakuwa anaona hiyo kitu William Ruto ataona hiyo kitu so tuko hapa na tubanduki eh yeah. imefanya leo ikahairishwa sababu ya brokers ya Raila brokers wa wenye si kitu ya Raila hii ODM 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 nomination hii ni bunge la wananchi au brokers bila kuwataja majina ni watu wa ni watu wa gani kwa jamii au brokers au ma brokers wanakujanga sana sana hapa wanasema hii ni watu wao wote wana wanaenda kwa mwanasiasa fulani anawapea kama 100,000 alafu wanakuja hapa kulazimisha watu wampigie kura. Na wanaenda hata huko kwa ofisi ya Raila eti anasema tuko na tuko na mtu fulani ambao wananchi wanampenda na wananchi wampendi. Ndio maana kama ODM hapa hakuna mbunge. Hakuna mbunge wa ODM sababu ya brokers. Raila akona akona high chance sana kupata nini kupata mbunge hata governor akipenda hapa na kuru because of money wanatumia mpaka maofisas. Because they have money. Sasa kama jana walisema ati ni uchaguzi ya ODM. Hii ya ODM 
Bunge hoi. hoi. Hapa kuna mtu wa ODM. Hakuna. Si kuna chama yote hapa. Yeah. Yeah. Sasa tunataka kuambia hao mabrokers ni they are the rebels and ni masetani wa hii bunge. Juu hii bunge ilikuwa isaidie kila mtu. Bunge hoi. Hoi. Hey, another question. Hii program ya Wednesday tutaanza kuanzia saa kumi na mbili na tunawakaribisha wote Kuanzia saa kumi na mbili na ise around saa antano hivi Na tutakuwa na weshimewa pia e, Tutakuwa na weshimewa Support gani unazataka kutoka kwa government kama hini wanapunga? Oh, si, si si support ni tunazataka kwa government ni kutupia security Iyo peke yake Juhu si si, si watu wanja Sisi si watu wanjaa sana. Hii hii hi ni kukosoa government. Juu hii government inatufinya sana. Ndio maana tumeanzisha hii kitu. Hatutaki support yake, support yake ni kupea mwananchi security ya kutosa. Any support about money we don't want. We want the security ya kutete ku support nyinyi hapa, ku protect sisi hapa. Yeah. Another question? Another another question? My my my, my boss you can ask any any question? Is there any question? Kusawa. Kusawa? Yeah. Aya, tunataka kumaliza bunge hoi. Hoi. Inua mikono yako juu tumalize. Hoi. Na urudia hii maneno. Bunge hoi. Hoi. Bunge hoi. Hoi. Urudia hii maneno. Sema mimi kama mwana Kenya. Mimi kama mwana Kenya. Ambaye ya mefinywa na maisa. Ambaye ya mefinywa na maisa. Kwa serekali mbaya ya ruto. Kwa serekali mbaya ya ruto. Nime simama hapa leo. Nime simama hapa leo. Kutetea haki ya kila mutu. Kutetea haki ya kila mutu. Ya mtoto wangu. Ya mtoto wangu. Na wajuku wangu. Na wajuku wangu. Hii serekali ya mbabandia. Hii serekali ya mbabandia. Iweze kusikiliza maoni ya wanainchi. Iweze kusikiliza maoni ya wanainchi. Ipunguze bei ya garama ya maisha. Ipunguze bei ya garama. Na e mungu watusaidia tutoe hii madambazi. Mungu watusaidia tutoe hii madambazi. Asanteni sana tumemaliza. Asanteni.